Girl, you okay? If you got a life alert, girl, now's the time to press that button. Oh, wait, this is a hair tutorial or a concussion Ooh. tutorial? So she thought it was a good idea to put her friend inside a pull-out couch. And, and she stuck. Like a duck. With no luck. Oh, look, a hand. We're making progress. Story time. So here is me running inside to grab something really quick. I obviously forget to put the Jeep in park. So when I come outside, I realize it is missing. <gasps> I go back in, wake my entire house up, no. keep in mind this is 2 a.m., and tell my parents that someone had stolen the car. Turns out it had rolled up the street and parked in my neighbor's yard. Bro, it done stole itself. It's like, I ain't being cheated right here. I'm an off-road vehicle. Stop using me to run errands. This is Jeep abuse. I'm gonna go where somebody will appreciate me. Maybe the neighbors. Maybe their lawn. This is probably the only off-roading experience is gonna get us whole entire Jeep life. So a couple weeks ago, this woman went viral because she ran out of hairspray and put Gorilla Glue all over her scalp. I can't make this up. My hair has been like this for about a month now. It's not my choice. When I do my hair, I like to, you know, finish it off with a little got to be glue spray. I didn't have any more got to be glue spray, so I used this. Gorilla Glue Spray. Bad idea. I don't run out of face wash and then go grab the Windex under my sink and just... No, ain't nobody do that. But she was like, hmm, it's in a can that can like spray. So like, this might just work. My hair, it don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? It don't move. I've washed my hair 15 times. At least it looks smooth. Like you ain't got to do nothing else to it. It's like permanent haircut. And it don't move. Yeah, because those follicles, they can't breathe. Don't ever ever use this oh you think you think oh she giving me advice now like you know i already thought that was like common sense i don't even know what to say right over here and put it over there got it bro this is the first time you can't put like a five-year-old in a forklift and be like hey yo go be do careful. this pick that up here, put okay? it there oh those are sharp go to your right to your right to your right no, to your right you're going left right. oh. uh-oh was right big uh oh right there and the kid is just like bro you didn't give me time to like pull up my finger so i know where the left and the right is y'all rushing me so this is why they call it a forklift like you see the way it just like stabbed into that truck like it was a dang baked potato why would you do that i got a new car i just wanted to take her out for a drink baby girl what you like pepsi no frappuccino try this caramel water because you thirsty you put it in the windshield wiper fluid and it all came out the back y'all ever see a hyundai with explosive diarrhea there it is here we got a fabulous photo of Mount Rushmore. You know, the presidents were carved into the mountain. Crazy how nature make that. Oh, yes, George Washington. He was the chosen one. That mountain, it just chose him. He was working at McDonald's before he got recognized to become president. They were like, hey, y'all, that's the dude of the mountain. He can run our country. Did you ever stop and think, like, maybe they carved their faces into the mountain? Like, take a dang chip and a hammer and just, like, wabam? No, nature did that. That was there since the dinosaurs. Crazy coincidence, I know. Guys, I'm not trying to judge, but what is this girl doing? <laughs> I snotted. What is she doing? Bro, she ain't even lifting the bar. That's it. That's my Instagram workout for the day. Some people be doing this and be like, why don't I have a six pack yet? So this 